Stop That Shopping Cart is the fourth episode of the seventh and final season of Minnie's Spotoons, or at least final to date. And this is also, of course, the fourth episode of the second season of Party Pals Pals. This one is actually set neither in the apartment or at the boutique. This is actually set in, as you can imagine, a supermarket or a grocery store. And the attention to detail in this is brilliant. The products on the shelves are so detailed. Sometimes we have just batch jobs of generic shapes, boxes and things. But actually there are a lot of little details here and there that I found really pleasant to watch. It's very well animated. And basically there is a rogue shopping cart and they have to try and stop it before it knocks down a whole stand of different products and it's very chaotic and to be honest it's a scene that I can imagine happening in a supermarket particularly if there's a, a, a young child around pushing the cart and true story I once was pushing a shopping cart or a trolley and pushed it straight into a, an aisle of um, alcohol that went everywhere. So definitely have some kind of um, memories triggered by this episode. I thought the attention to detail was brilliant. The narrative itself is not that interesting to me for a young child watching it. I can see the excitement. I can see the, race, the, the, the rush of energy as they're, you know, wondering what's going to happen. Is the cart going to collide? Is there going to be just a calamitous disaster? Or are they going to be able to solve this? You can definitely find some emotional investment if you want to find it. But for me, it was just the attention to detail that I really liked. I thought it was a very well, a very well animated episode. Um, Goofy was in it as well, which is always nice. And Ludwig von Drake, it's always nice when we get some of the other Sensational Six and other supporting characters in Bowtoons, because quite often it is just Minnie and Daisy and Cuckoo Loca. So it's nice to have a little bit of a, a variety in there at times. It's not one of my personal favourite episodes, but I thought it worked very well. Figaro was in it. Always a bonus. I absolutely adore Figaro, of course. So stop that sharp, sh sharping cart. I don't know why that's such a mouthful for me to say, but stop that shopping cart is definitely very well animated with a relatively interesting narrative. 